Hi there Tom, I just wanted to uh, shoot a little video for you. I'm not going to be able to get the lenses out today. Um, it's taking quite a bit longer than expected. This is the prototype, this is uh, the very very first lens that um, I've got servoed up in this way to be honest. So it's been a little bit tricky working it all out, getting it all right. But uh, yeah, what I've decided to do, it's like there's a um, some foil inside at the moment but uh, yeah so you can see the foil what I decided to do is basically I've made the eye lens so it's totally ready for you all you've got to do basically is when you receive it is um, just put your servo straight on the back and then secure your servo in whatever way you want to secure it if you want to put two little blocks on the back or whatever but I'm um, just waiting for this to dry at the moment so as you can see the uh, actual spline for the servo is is there, smack bang in the middle, um, pretty ready for you. So all you've got to do is just slot your servo um, spline into the key, in, into its location, and away you go. Um, okay, let's take this back off for you. Please bear with me. So I've just loosened it off slightly so it's finger tight, and with me having the camera in the other hand. These come in very handy for loosening it and tightening it up. Um, okay, as you can see, there's some foil sitting in there at the moment. That's just to make sure that um, I didn't drip any araldite onto the diffuser, because obviously that would make a, a mess of things. So once this is dried, then that can then come out. But uh, I think this should work quite well. Um, as you see we've got we've got that brass bar in there. Copper sorry. Which is um, soldered to the brass. And then we've got um, the servo horn epoxied in there. Once that's dried I'll then be doing um, another coat of epoxy from the other side so I'm going to put some epoxy so we can do that. Um, and it and it all goes together really nice to be honest. Um, so what the one thing I did have with this um, particular lens is um, it has to be dismantled to um, do what I've needed to do because I have to put another slot into the retainer for the iris. But um, one issue I did have I was finding that. Um, it was binding up, the iris was, so I, I, I've sorted that out now, that seems to be okay, so, alright then, just wanted to show you this, so, okie dokie, um, I think I'd like to uh, try a servo on there after it's completed, and uh, I'd like to actually see it operate, so. Um, once this one's done I'll be working on doing the same to the other eye lens and then if I can get them both done in time um, for before dinner time um, tomorrow then I'll get them out tomorrow um, if not it's going to have to be Monday because uh, post office closes at 12 o'clock tomorrow Okay then Tom, thanks and uh, bye for now. I hope you like what you've seen on the video. I uh, just, just thought I'd do it properly and um, just get it nice and ready for you so you can drop your micro servo straight on there. Okay, thanks. Bye for now.